hot times for Werder Bremen recently. Last season, just position number 10 in the table. The visitors here today, Eintracht Frankfurt, finished on 13th. And if they hadn't have conceded those 60 goals that only Hanover and Gladbach, who collected more, then maybe they could have finished a little higher than this team, Bremen. The first chance of the game, two minutes for Torsten Frinks and Bremen here in green and white. Almeida's header and Sonogo in the centre. He's just returned from loan, back from Hoffenheim. Not an easy ball for him. That was a clearance by Russ, back in from Hugo Almeida. And then Sonogo. Four minutes later, after the throw-in from Patrick Ox. Good ball from Tabor. Meyer, Tabor's cross into the centre. And Amanatidis, the ex-captain from Frankfurt, who was dropped for Christoph Spiecher. He made it there to the delight of this man. The head coach, Michael Skibber. 1-0 for the visitors. Good ball in from Selim Tabor. Amanatidis with a cool, calm, collected finish. Just seven appearances last season due to injury worries that he had. He has returned. On 12 minutes, the home team plucking up courage, and especially with this man here, Mesut Özil inside the box and then the boot from Vazowski gets him on the right boot and down he goes little smile on his face and the referee gave the penalty all the same Vazowski did connect but whether it was a penalty you can make up your own decisions there your own minds Mesut Özil Fine form by the under-21 internationals for Germany, taking the title, the European Championships. And in good form again here with a penalty. So that was back in business, 1-1 game on. 28 minutes, Özil involved yet again. But he can't get more involved without scoring, he hit the post. Good work from Pazanen, Amborowski and Özil. Just out of luck at the end of the day. Thomas Scharf knew that his team had to step up a gear. But on half an hour, it was Amanatidis in the centre. Good work from Schwegler, who should have made it 2-1, surely. He'd already scored one for his team, and uh, that was such an easy tap-in. 42 minutes. And this was Patrick Ox. Meyer with the header, Amanatidis with the goal, 2-1 for Frankfurt. Two goals last season in his seven appearances on his first in the Bundesliga, this time around. Two goals already, Amanatidis. Meyer with the header, nobody with him. And Sebastian Prödel, the defender with the... Number 11 there, he came away from the blind line much too late. Austrian international giving Amanatidis the golden opportunity and he took it in style. So that was on 42 minutes. And then with just a minute to go. Before the half-time whistle, this was Clemens Fritz and then Frings. And then as the ball arrives to Patrick Ox. It was Sanogo who got it in for 2-2. But take a look at the goalkeeper, Nikolov, who flapped in the air. Here's a cross from Frings. Missed it completely. Ox can't get it, as Sanogo can. That's the man that's missing. That disappeared to Juventus, Diego. He's not here anymore. It's up to the boys in green and white. Here is Frings. Marco Marin, another new signing from Gladbach, and then... Zoski got in the way. And that was a good job too because on the far side it was Almeida who was ready to bounce. Just a couple of minutes into the second half and the home team were looking to increase the lead. Marine again. Marco Marine. That was a shot come cross. Nikolov with the save. Then on 71, the corner for Patrick Ox. 
Tabor's header, and then literally it came off Fenin to go in for the 3 2. Werder Bremen did not know what hit them. Martin Fenin, the 22 year old Czech international, five goals last season, one here he couldn't do anything about. He was just in the right place. But they all count. Three minutes later, another counter attack from Frankfurt. Kula, good work. Nice one two as well with Kayo and Fenin. And then Fenin found a position to shoot from Tim Visa. The man who has been nominated for the upcoming World Cup qualifiers for Germany. Scharf, not a happy man to say the least. And that was all over. The referee, Dr. Fleischer, blew the final whistle. Nothing to do. Werder Bremen again got off to a disastrous start in the new season, losing at home against Eintracht Frankfurt by three goals to two. Eintracht, a great start. And that can continue. Schaaf, back to the drawing board.